Now to vote 2016. It is day three of the Democratic the National Convention in Philadelphia. The this is a live look there of what's happening on that stage there tonight. And in just a couple of hours, President Obama is going to take the stage. It'll be his third Democratic convention speech. But just a short dozen years ago, President Obama was a political unknown from Chicago. Our chief political correspondent, Mark Davis, is here now with a look back at the political predictions Connecticut Democrats had for the then 43-year-old state senator. Mark. Hi, Darren and Ann. Good evening, everyone from the Hartford Newsroom. Yes, it was 12 years ago tonight that Connecticut Democrats were making big predictions for Barack Obama. He exceeded everyone's predictions. There is not a liberal America and a conservative America. There is the United States of America. There is not a black America and a white America and Latino America and Asian America. There's the United States of America. This was the speech 12 years ago tonight that put a 43-year-old state senator from Illinois on the national political map. Tonight, after nearly eight years in office, President Obama will deliver his final major political address aimed at boosting the campaign of Hillary Clinton and extending his political legacy. Twelve years ago this week, the young Obama was the talk of the Connecticut Democratic delegates. Here's what some of them said about his future. If he stay on course, he's going to be a dynamite. He could be anything. He could be vice president of this country someday down the road. He has a very compelling personal story. As to where he's headed, I hope the first step is to the U.S. Senate. And after that, time will tell, I guess. Who knows, another, you know, 15 years from now or so, we'll be seeing a different America with diversity on the top ticket in the United States. 15 years. Uh, that's what some of the Connecticut delegates were saying 12 years ago tonight after that Obama speech in Boston at the Democratic National Convention in 2004. They made predictions for him, but he exceeded all of them. Live from the Hartford Newsroom, Mark Davis, Museum.